So I wanted to do a, a different video than what I normally do. Um, I always do my reach out videos every day. And I get a lot of people that, that respond back and, and ask a lot of different questions and, and go, you know, what is it that you do that, that helps you um, stay very motivated and, and not fall back into depression and not have mad anxiety? And the biggest thing that I, I tell everybody is you've got to get a routine down um, because it really sets off the pace of your day. Like for myself, I, I get up every day at, uh, at 4.30. That's that's what the plan is. Um, I fell off of that for a little bit here the last couple, uh, almost two weeks, and I noticed a huge difference um, just because of work and everything else going on. Get that routine down, though, um, it, whether it just be setting your bed in the morning. It just just small little accomplishments that kind of build on each other, and it builds motivation in you. Like, like for myself, I've gotten to the point that I wake up at 4.30, um, I do some journaling, um, and, and what I mean by journaling, you can do it anyway. I, I have a journal uh, that I write in, but I also have a ton of uh, notes and everything in my phone. Uh, just when a thought and something you know gets to my brain, uh, I write it down so it's stuff that I can review and stuff that I can look over. And it helps my brain start kind of firing off for the day, and then uh, I end up working out in the morning. After that, I take my, uh, my dog for a walk. And it, it, that's more of my meditation time. I, I love listening to music. It, it's soothing. It, it keeps the brain going. And it doesn't let me focus on a lot of the negatives and, and a lot of the stresses in life um, where you really start to build that, that self-doubt, that, that anxiety. The, um, you start to get depressed because you, you fall into that hole a little bit and you, you start letting the, the weight of the world start to really hit on your shoulders. And then after that, I, I get ready and start, you know, start my day. I, I end up making my coffee. Um, and it's very structured and and for me personally, I have to keep it that way It makes it so much easier for me because I know what to expect and, and I don't have any surprises uh, And it sets the day off to the, just the right tone So if it's one of those things and, and you're struggling where it comes to you know, how, how do I even start my day? My suggestion is just get a routine down and if you need help getting a routine down like like my videos always say you know reach out to me i'm more than happy to talk to you about it to share with you mine um love to hear what you do um because it's all about people helping people and that's what it's about and apparently my dog wants to uh to play with me right now but uh you know get get that down it, you'll notice a huge difference and it it doesn't happen overnight it takes a little while to give it a week give it two weeks and it's a little bit of trial and error seeing what works for you um, because we are all a little bit different. So I just really wanted to share that with you because a lot of people have hit me up on uh, regards to, you know, what, what do I really do to start trying to break out of this a little bit where I don't want to go on to medication yet. I, you know, I've, I've talked to a therapist and, and it just kind of comes down to tools. So my biggest suggestion is, you know, start trying to journal um, or, or keep a calendar, something that you can start kind of getting your brain to activate and work in the morning. And, uh, you know, work out. Exercise is huge. Gets the blood flowing. It, it, it gets your alone time. And, you know, make sure you have that self-maintenance every day because you need it. Um, I hope you got a little bit of something out of this. But if it's one of those days and, and you need some help, you need some support, I'm here for you. I'm Eric. I'm a recovering addict. Um, I've had two family members commit suicide. I struggled with depression before. I'm ADHD. Um, you name it, I've, I've probably have been through a little bit of it, and uh, it's okay to be not okay, and uh, together we can do this, and it's all about we, because every day is a battle, and it's so much easier not to have to do it alone, and to have support out there, because you don't have to suffer silently. We're all in it together, and we can all share our experiences and make this so much more enjoyable and so much easier on us all. So I hope you have a beautiful day today. It's Saturday, so go out and enjoy the day.